subscribe, click the bell, and turn on all notifications. The one-stop destination for all WWE and AEW. Sean's View Entertainment. We are brash and we're going to outlast. Remember to refresh, refresh, refresh this channel multiple times a day around the clock. WWE news and rumors. I want your comments, your opinions. We're going to be discussing the heat that Matt Riddle has backstage in the WWE. He ruffled the feathers of Roman Reigns. Is this going to be the deep push of Matt Riddle? Is Matt Riddle going to be out of the Raw Tag Team title picture? We're also going to be discussing the perhaps in-ring return of AJ Lee. CM Punk has spoke about that. But let's get right into it, ladies and gentlemen, without a matter of fact. By way of ringside news and Wrestling Observer Radio this week, Dave Meltzer brought up how Matt Riddle is portrayed as a fool sometimes on WWE programming. One who doesn't know what he's saying. This is reflective of real life as he went on to explain how those comments Riddle made about Roman Reigns didn't land favorable within the backstage area. His mouth gets him in trouble a lot, including last week. It's not like it's going to hurt his push because Vince likes him and everything, but he ruffled some feathers again with his comments on Roman Reigns, where he said in a real fight he could beat him up and how Roman Reigns isn't a needle mover. Those were based on Roman statements about CM Punk, which did not age particularly well. Now, I'll say this. Matt Riddle has had his uh, problems, his drama, his conflict with Goldberg even in the past. And now it's going over to Roman Reigns, the universal champion. I, I say this, you know, I know Matt Riddle, you know, he might be a little bit immature. He might be a little bit high. He might be a little bit fry, sky, my lie. But the fact of the matter is, is when those cameras are on, Matt Riddle can go. Matt Riddle is on. Matt Riddle is is um, one of the best on Raw today. He's an up-and-comer, uh, he's a stud, and he's one half of the Raw Tag Team Champions. As a matter of fact, Matt Riddle is one of the reasons why I can somehow, some way, get through a three-hour Monday Night Raw. And believe me, viewers, when I tell you, it's not easy to get through a three-hour Monday Night Raw uh, with the kind of conflicts and the kind of changes and the kind of um, ways that Raw is being run these days because we're in a goddamn haze. But ladies and gentlemen, upon all that... Matt Riddle, Roman Reigns, that would make for a good match. Uh, one day, I could almost see that as a headline or a, at a Royal Rumble or perhaps even, dare I say, a WrestleMania. One day, once Matt Riddle gets built up more in a singles run because we all know that Randy Orton is going to elevate Matt Riddle. And again, I think what Matt Riddle is doing on Raw is some of his best work in WWE. And you know what? The thing about Matt Riddle is, is could he defeat Roman Reigns in a real fight? Probably because he's got MMA background, MMA uh, superior. Superior. You know, what about Riddle versus Lesnar? What about Riddle versus Lashley? I mean, some great matches could come out of that. But in a WWE match, I think Roman Reigns has uh, has uh, the high one, the high one, Matt Riddle all day. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, we can't switch it up to MMA or UFC in the WWE. Although the WWE does need to find a way. Speaking of the, about the UFC, CM Punk has officially retired from the UFC. Uh, and speaking about that, A.J. Lee, uh, there's a lot, of, a lot of speculation. There's a lot of rumors. Uh, there's a lot of people saying that A.J. Lee's going to return now that CM Punk's back. But CM Punk went on the record to kill the rumors and say that there will be no A.J. Lee return to wrestling. She might be in wrestling, perhaps, but she, will, she won't be wrestling because her neck. And, you know, that's a lot of issues with a lot of wrestlers. Their necks, uh, their backs, um, the surgeries. You know, but, the, you know, we've seen Edge come back. You know, we've seen Daniel Bryan come back. Um, but... With AJ Lee perhaps being a little bit more fragile, perhaps, perhaps, than Edge or Daniel Bryan, maybe her neck wouldn't be the best to put her neck on the line. So CM Punk commented that AJ Lee, we probably won't be seeing her in the ring. And that's a very sad state of uh, fears, ladies and gentlemen. Because AJ Lee was one of the greatest WWE divas of all time. Her career was cut short, kind of like Paige's career was cut short. But I think right now, I think there, was, there would be more of a chance that we would see Paige come back uh, then we would see of uh, A.J. Lee come back. And remember, Paige and A.J. Lee, very instrumental those two were in each other's careers. But viewers and subscribers, do you think Matt Riddle will be in trouble? What kind of heat will he have on him? How will he respond to the reaction that Matt Riddle will get uh, if he he is in trouble? And uh, how far the trouble will go? Will he be fined? Will he be suspended? Uh, w what is going to happen with, with Matt Riddle? And with all these releases happening in the WWE, Bray Wyatt, Braun Strowman, Buddy Murphy, the list goes on and on and on and on. And these aren't just names. These are top names. These are guys that were in top storylines in WrestleMania, guys that were featured prominently on Raw and SmackDown. They were released, viewers. And uh, again, I, you know, I hope Matt Riddle's position doesn't get de-pushed because of what he said and what he did about Roman Reigns. Because we all know that Roman Reigns is at the top of his mountain. Roman Reigns is at the top of his game. And uh, Matt
Matt Riddle, maybe he was just speaking truth. Well, Roman Reigns doesn't really move the needle. He doesn't think that Roman Reigns moves the needle. Well, he certainly does move the needle more than CM Punk does. Because even though CM Punk, you know, he got a lot of hype. He made it right. CM Punk had a good impression. But I almost feel as if the CM Punk bandwagon is almost, it's almost kind of like dying down a little bit, viewers. And I don't want to admit that, and I don't want to say that, but that's what I'm feeling. And that's just my opinion here on Show and View Entertainment, where we keep it prolific, consistent, and dedicated. So, ladies and gentlemen, what are your thoughts on Matt Riddle? Uh, his comments about Roman Reigns about perhaps being in hot water, the WWE higher-ups not liking the comments that R Riddle said. Matt Riddle probably doesn't even remember what he said because he's high half the time, if not all the time. I know on Raw with Randy Orton, he's always high. Um, but no, I think Matt Riddle will move up the ranks. Matt Riddle will be uh, coming into his own. And uh, Matt Riddle is uh, fundamentally sound. And even though he's as high as the sky, the sky, I think, is the limit for Matt Riddle when it is all said and done. So viewers and subscribers, what I am looking forward to is your reaction, your comments, your feedback, because it's all about your comments. Remember to share my videos on Facebook and Twitter because Sean View Entertainment wouldn't have it any other way. Go check out all my other videos, viewers. Um, again, we work around the clock. What does that mean, I work around the clock? Well, I'll provide you uh, videos around the clock, viewers. As many videos, as much news as there is, I'll be here every hour, every other hour, every few hours. I'll be here as much as I can, as much as the news allows it, as much as YouTube allows it. Sean View Entertainment will be right here for each and every one of you because that's what I do here on Sean View Entertainment. But again, ladies and gentlemen, is it sad that we won't see AJ Lee returning to wrestling again? Yes, it is sad, but we're going to have to deal with it. It is what it is. We don't want to see AJ Lee wind up in a wheelchair. You know, every time Edge wrestles, I, I am like, oh, my God, what's going to happen? Like, I, I, I'm on the edge of my seat thinking, oh, man, I hope he doesn't get hurt. I hope he doesn't get injured. I hope he doesn't get re-injured. You know, I almost cringe when I see Edge wrestle because you know his history. You know where he's been. And then, you know, we saw what happened with Paige and what Sasha Banks did to her. Um, you know, a lot of people saying a lot of different things about whose fault it really was and this, that, and the other. But when you're in the wrestling business, uh, that's what happens, ladies and gentlemen. When you're in the wrestling business, you take that chance. No romance. Although there's some romance between Punk and AJ Lee. But viewers and subscribers, this is the place to be. I am the face that books this place. Sean's View Entertainment. And viewers, we are just getting rolling. Remember, it is the reset. It is the reboot. It is the re-energized Sean View here full-time, all the time, for each and every one of you, whether you agree, disagree, or we can agree to disagree. What have you? Sean View Entertainment is here. We are here to score. We are here to settle. And we are here because this is what it's all about. The news, the rumors, the headlines. Let's just hope that Matt Riddle isn't on the outside looking in after what he said about the tribal chief more to come from the brash remember refresh my channel subscribe smash that bell turn on all notifications and you will get the needle moving on sean's view entertainment because sean view will be innovating and sean view entertainment is going to raise the bar because it's all about maximizing and that's what Matt Riddle, I think, was trying to do. Maybe maybe Matt Riddle was trying to get more attention. I think Matt Riddle's already got enough attention on him. I think Matt Riddle always ha already has enough attention on him. He don't need a hell of a lot more attention on him than what he has already garnered. Because, again, Matt Riddle, you don't want to be brittle. And can Roman Reigns solve the riddle that is Matt? Or will Matt Riddle be hitting the mat once Roman Reigns hits him with a Superman punch? Because, as we all know, Roman Reigns has now completed over a full year as the WWE SmackDown Universal Heavyweight Champion of this world. Subscribe. Stay tuned. More to come.